Uh, hey there, friends. Uh, it's Mike Peninga. It is uh, Sunday, April the 29th. Uh, it's around 7 o'clock in the morning. I was up today at 5 o'clock. Um, lots of uh, emotions uh, swirling through my head. This is my final Sunday at KGF. Uh, just over nine years serving uh, in this KGF church family, being blessed by this KG KGF church family. And I, uh, I woke up early today just because of all the things that are ahead on my final day, all the goodbyes, um, all the chances to say thank you and to give hugs, which is amazing. Um, yeah, it's crazy. For those of you that don't know, I, uh, we are going to be taking three months as a break, May, June, July, and then August 1st, I begin a new chapter in our story. Uh, working at Kelowna Christian School in the area of advancement director, so helping raise the funds and advance in the school and overseeing spiritual life, creating a, a culture of discipleship among the 700 plus students and the staff and the families and the community. It's going to be amazing. So we're not leaving Kelowna, uh, but this is a big day and it's kind of an emotional day and it makes you think back to when I began at KGF. Uh, there were three things that I wanted to, to do and the first was to love people. I sought to do that uh, each and every day, and it's been an absolute joy to do that. Uh, secondly, to inspire hope. Uh, I came to KGF in a season where KGF was wondering, is the best behind us? Is there a future for us? And I believe that with God there is always hope. The best is always yet to come. Uh, so first, to love people. Second, to inspire hope. And third, to point them to Jesus. And uh, Every Sunday, uh, what I want to tell people is you need Jesus. <laughs> you need Jesus. He is the hope. Uh, he is the one who first loved. Uh, he is the one who came looking for you to bring you home. And so uh, that's been my message. Um, I've been accused of being a simple preacher. <laughs> that's okay. I have a simple message. Uh, the gospel is good news. I was talking to someone, uh, just uh, at Alpha, and this guy uh, was saying to me, sometimes uh, we can't say simply what Christianity is. Well, I'll tell you what Christianity is. Christianity is one word, Jesus. Um, the second word is grace. Um, but uh, Christianity means that God came near to bring you home. It means that you are not alone. It means that your sins can be forgiven. It means that uh, life eternal is open to you. Grace means all of this is a free gift. All of this is given not because you are somehow worth it, uh, but because God looks at you and sees you as worthy. So that's been my message these nine years. That will be my life moving forward. I'm so excited uh, to see and to show to people that my love for Jesus is not limited to a title or to a position or to a certain community. That I love Jesus whether I'm a pastor with that title or not. And... Um, yeah, because you can, uh, wherever you are, you can be a follower of Christ, you can be a shepherd of others, uh, you can be one who advances the good news. So, just some of my thousands of reflections of nine years of serving. I was thinking 450 Sundays at KGF, more than a thousand services, and every service we close with uh, a benediction, final word, his word, and those three words, you are loved. Um, so I will do that this morning. And if you're able to join us, 9 a.m., 10.45 a.m., KGF, Gordon and Casorso, or live online, uh, kgfchurch.com slash stream. It has been an absolute joy and a privilege uh, to be your pastor, to serve you in this capacity. Uh, thank you for the way that you have loved and poured your lives out for the name of Christ. Keep doing that. Keep following hard after Jesus because he is worth it and he is good and you are amazing. Have an awesome day. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye.